carrying a Zika and I'm just responding to a question that was asked following my um, flawless skin video. To get rid of a blind spot, and for those who don't um, know what a blind spot is, it's when you have just a, a, a pimple or a spot that just grows and it doesn't have a white head or a black head. Um, and it's just a blind spot and you can't squeeze it and you can't like pick it or anything. It's one of those like pimples that like nag you and you're just like, oh, what the hell? Um, so what I tend to do is that you, everyone knows now that I steam my face about three times a week. So um, when I miss that and um, my skin breaks out or something happens and I have a blind spot or if I eat too much chocolate, <laughs> I tend to um, steam it to make sure that the, the white stuff comes to the top, to the surface, and then I just squeeze it. Or I take um, a cotton bud um, and dip it in hot water if I don't have time to steam my face. And I just dab it onto the pimple to draw the white hair to the surface. Um, and then I just squeeze it. But make sure you don't squeeze it so much that the blood starts coming up because that's when you have like... A mark left or something so what you need to do is to just squeeze it enough to make sure that the white head is out and your pimple um, flattens out again and um, yeah that was the first question what I do for that question um, for like dry skin or dry spots or if you squeeze your pimple too much and you've got like a scab on your face um, what I tend to do is um, not wear as much makeup or not wear makeup at all and uh, my friends know that I don't usually put on makeup anyways only when I'm doing videos or if I'm going out um, so just try not to wear as much makeup don't wear it if it's not necessary because what you're doing is that you're not allowing your skin to breathe and your skin won't heal um, normally the way it's supposed to so try not to wear as much uh, makeup or you know all that stuff and just um, moisturize your face um, a lot yeah and moisturize the the scab and then eventually it will be able you can just pick it off or just scratch it off um, and then you'll just you won't have like a, a black mark or um, spots on your face so that's the video response to those two questions um, thank you hope you find this useful bye see you in the next video <laughs> bye